The Trinidad and Tobago Fire Service has additional manpower with the recent graduation of 167 fire officers of Batch 1 2018-2019. At the recent passing out parade held at the Brian Lara Stadium in Taruba, the new firefighters showed off their skills. The first batch of 126 men and 41 women went through four months of training. Chief Fire Officer Roosevelt Bruce said, out of 6,000 applicants who sat the written exam, only 50% passed the physical exam. He told the recruits they have to come into the fire service at a time when their services are needed. With the prediction of the, of the weather gurus, we are going to have a very rough dry season. So I guess it's safe to say you will be having a baptism of fire. Maybe bushfires. CFO Bruce said the TTFS has a vision to become the premier training academy not only in Trinidad and Tobago but in the Caribbean region. However, he said the fire service is without a permanent training facility. In 2009, we moved from the Shagaramas training facility to the Savaneta fire station, hoping that we will soon receive a home. But as I said before, I believe in perseverance, and we will continue to persevere, and we will receive a state-of-the-art training academy in the not-too-distant future. The chief fire officer said they will continue to strive for a new administration building, for new equipment, and will continue to do human service to the people of Trinidad and Tobago. He advised the recruits to accept the challenges and persevere. Even if it appears to be impossible, that is what the Trinidad and Tobago Fire Service is. We rush in where people run. When everyone is scared and run, they call on the Trinidad and Tobago Fire Service and we rush in. You are well trained. You are trained enough to accept the challenge. 